Hey everybody, Crafty Geek here. It is Friday, May 20th. I'm sorry, May 20th. It's the weekend, yay! Oh goodness, what has happened since Mother's Day? Well, my husband and me went and saw Def Leppard when they came here to our city. We saw, it was Tesla, which he was extremely happy about. REO, which I was who I was happy to see, and Def Leppard, and it was a really, really good concert. It was a great show. The guys still got it, so it was really nice. It was actually a postponed concert. Um, it was supposed to happen back in February, I think, and the lead singer had gotten sick, so they postponed it. Which, you know what? It happens to all of us, right? So he definitely needed rest. Same thing kind of like what happened to ZZ Top. We were supposed to see ZZ Top back in April, but he fell in Lubbock, Texas, so and busted his shoulder up, so I think it got postponed all the way to October, I think. Yeah, October. So uh, I'm sure that'll be, that'll be another one worth the wait. So it, life gets in the way and things just happen sometimes. Um, what else has been going on? Um, I've purged out a lot of my craft room and I've got a lot of my items for sale um, in, a, in a scrap of garage sale that's happening tomorrow actually. I'll be, I will be at Hot and House tomorrow helping out the owner Faith calculate everything. It's just helping her out as a friend while hoping to sell a lot of my stuff that's going to help pay for my weekend with Diane Ravely. So. If you're in the Shreveport Bossier area or North Louisiana and you want to come find some good deals, go to Hot and House tomorrow. It's from 9 to 3. I would get there early because there's always been a line there, but you find some really, really, really good deals. So if you're in the market or in the area, I would I would come. It's a, it's a great deal. Um, and you'll be helping out a lot of lo us local people take, take some stuff off our hands as they always say in garage sales. Um, I've been, let's see, I did decorate my planner this week. Uh, let me see if I can, where did I put my planner on? Well, it's here somewhere. No a moment. But, um, what else has been happening? Well, so, where is my planner? I don't know where it is, so... Um, I do have what I decorated it with right here, so I'll, I'll just have to show you that for this week. Um, this is the coveted watercolor splash washi that a lot of people have been trying to look for, and I was able to get them. And they are beautiful. They are really, really nice. I got this one, and I got the one with words on it. And actually, let's see, this week, this week I decorated it with the words. Last week I decorated with just the colors and everything, but they are really, really pretty. But I've heard more have been have come out in stores, so you should be able to get them now. Um, there were a bunch of new rolls or tubes that were put out, and this past week at Michael's they had a really good deal in the paper crafting section. It was buy one get one free, so I did a lot of personal shopping for a lot of people. So. And that was a lot of fun. Believe me, it was very tempting to get some of my own rolls, but I was good. I've been saving my money because for my trip in July. But also to save up for a possible family trip in the fall, we were thinking about going up to Branson, Missouri in October, which I think it would be really nice because it won't be the high holiday tourist times. People kids will still be in school so I'm, I'm thinking there really should be a line to anything especially if we go to Silver, Silver Dollar City and go to some other shows I don't think they'll be that crowded because it's a slow time in October and I'm just assuming with it being the fall the weather will be very very nice um, let's see. this will be a little fun thing for me to open up in front of y'all okay yeah I'm sure if you see my previous videos what my husband got one of the gifts my husband got me for Mother's Day were these cute little vinyl Titan figures and I told you he started something so today I, I got off work early today so I went and did a couple of errands 
I brought some more items up to the garage sale, so I'm actually selling a bunch of my Cricut items because I did sell my Cricut, so I don't need the cartridges anymore, so I'm hoping someone takes them off my hands tomorrow because I don't need to bring them home because I don't have a Cricut anymore. But I'm going to do something a little fun right here. I am actually going to open this up on camera to see, and you get to see with me what I got. Um, yes, I got these at Hot Topic. I think it was actually buy one and get one 30% off, so it was worth getting two of them. The first one I had gotten before that I opened up before, it was one Tim said more, so who is it this time? Let's see which one is here. So, drum roll. Which one is it? Ah, who is it? Who is it? It is a rare Terra dog. Oh my goodness. Because let's see. Come on this one, it says it's. Oh, let's see. This one is one in 20 chance of getting right there. So this is one of those rare. This is one of the rare ones to find. So I got the Terra dog to add to my desk. And let's see. Which one do I get to add to? Which one do I get to add to it? Which one is it? Which one? Let's see. Let me put it, it is. Who is it? It is. Peter Bankman. Good old Peter Bankman. Good old Bill Murray. And actually, I think this is so cute how you can actually, right here, you can actually attach. You can attach it if it'll let me. Let's see. Well, it's like I'm going to have a little bit of trouble, so I guess I'll have to do it this way. Here we go. So now I've got two of the Ghostbusters. I've got Winston. Now I can add the whole Peter Bankman to it. So look what I got right here. And actually, I'm going to comment on something about Ghostbusters. Okay. I know the third one is coming out in July, and I've... I've seen good and bad reviews about it. I've seen it's gotten, it has gotten, it has been voted as the worst trailer or video on YouTube. And in my opinion about the whole thing, okay, yes, it's a disappointment because Hale Ramis did pass away about two years ago. And of course, you know, I was a big fan of him. I actually met him when he filmed a movie here and I actually met him when I went and saw a movie here. Really, really great guy. So it was really nice to be able to meet him. And I'm one of those, I'm willing to give a movie a chance. Um, I don't like reading critics' reviews because I've been to, I've read them before and I've read some where it's like, great movie, really must see and everything. And I've gone to the movie and I've been very disappointed by it. So I think with this particular film, I know a lot of people are putting all these rant videos on, and I'm not going to do that. Um, I'm going to give the movie a chance. I mean, I do like some of the characters that are in it, and I think Melissa McCarthy is, is hilarious. And I think it's even funny seeing Thor or, um, oh my gosh, Chris Hemsworth play in it. You know, everyone's used to seeing him as Thor, so it's going to be interesting to see him play a little secretary guy. And the fact that some of the original cast are making a cameo appearances. So, I mean, that should, to me, that tells me something that they've given their blessings to the film. So, I, as I said, I will definitely, I will still see it. I'll, I do plan on going to see the original when it comes out in theaters for special night and everything. But I will go see the new one. And then I will give my honest opinion about it. But I will give it a chance. And that's, I can't give something a review that I haven't seen. And I can't base it just off of the trailer. I mean, sometimes trailers are good, sometimes they are bad. But I'm going to go see it because I am a Ghostbusters fan from the beginning. So that's my opinion on that. 
And that's my little rant about Ghostbusters and the new one coming out. Anyways, I know this is a little bit plant, somewhat planner, crafty, nerd type video. So <laughs> I'm going to leave it there because, let's see, I think tonight is going to be a family movie night. So I'm going to go ahead and sign off here. I hope everybody has a great weekend and I will see y'all next week. Bye.